Hi, in this problem, we're going to integrate this. So we have secant cube of v minus secant squared of v over secant of v minus one. And the whole thing is with respect to v. So the big problem here is the piece on the bottom here. So it looks like we can do something in the numerator here. We can pull out a secant squared. So let's try to do that. So we have the integral of, and then we'll pull out secant squared of v, and then put a parentheses here. And let's think, what do you multiply by secant squared in order to get secant cubed? Well, simply secant. And you can check, secant squared times secant is secant cubed. And then minus, because there's a minus, and then what do you multiply by secant squared to get secant squared? Just one. All of this is being divided by secant of v, minus one, and then here we have a dv. These cancel, so we're simply left with the integral of secant squared v. And then we have our dv. And now we're integrating, so we want to think backwards. So do we know a function whose derivative is secant squared? Well, the derivative of tangent is secant squared. When you integrate secant squared, you should just get tangent. This is the tangent of v plus our constant of integration, capital C. And that would be the final answer. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.